Good day. Thank you for joining me for another Atari 8-bit gameplay video. I've loaded up a game here, which uh, I didn't actually realize until I loaded it up, that is uh, originally, I think originally, or maybe simultaneously, an Atari 2600 game, which I did play. I did a, I did a video on a while back. If I think about it, I'll link to it here. When did I publish that? That was back in that was back in September, the 14th of September, 2022. So that was a couple months ago, almost now. Once I loaded it, though, I realized immediately that I had, in fact, done that. Okay, so I'm. It looks like option sets your starting level. I believe that's the same way the 2600 works. And, uh, here we go. Nice effect. Oh, whoop, that no, was not. Uh, now I need to remember how to play. I think I'm meant to grab those guys, right? Oh, get out of the way of those things. Right on. to keyboard play. This is very much a up and down and left and right game. Whoop. Smacked right into him. How about that for skill? Skill and raw talent. Oh, come on. Oh. If you wait too long, those things shoot across and do you in. Ah. Terrible. Absolutely terrible. Play. <laughs> on my part. Uh, let us, us, let me try that again. Do love the old color thing that the Ataris can do. I'm not sure what the... Uh, feels like those guys have already gone by, but I keep smacking into them. Once you get one of those units, whatever those are meant to be, you immediately get one of those. Oh. So I don't know if when those shoot across, you can shoot them in return. I'll have to try that. Yes, you can. Okay. Presumably, you do better by collecting them. Collecting them. <clears throat> I was just about to say, I'm trying to recall if you actually finish levels or if you just sort of progress through them by by increasing, ramping up the, of the difficulty. I don't know if this plays very much differently than uh, the 2600 version, to be honest. I, it's been a couple months since I played, and uh, this, I'm not sure if I mentioned this or, or already or not, this was a recommendation by uh, my friend Ballistic Coffee Boy, who, uh, who also said that he likes the uh, 2600 version better, which is fair enough. I'd have to probably fire it up and play it back to back here to have a real feel for that. Don't hit the tanks. Pro tip. Pro tip. Don't hit the tanks. Oh, what happens? Oh, you can shoot him from behind. Right. Right. It's a cool game. It's not taking significant advantage of the Atari 8-bit hardware, I don't think, but as a game goes, it's not bad. It's It plays equally well, I think, and possibly better on the 2600. I don't know. <clears throat> to me, it feels about the same. Again, I'd have to... Whoops, I'm too late. Probably. Yeah, you get nice points for grabbing those things. <clears throat> as far as I know, this is a purely points game. I, 
guess levels and points, but kind of the same thing in a way. Pardon me, I'm having real trouble with uh, phlegm in the last couple of days here. I don't feel sick, but yeah, anyway, you get a lot of, you get considerably more points for grabbing those little space eggs. We'll call them space eggs. Whoop! Too late. Oh, and then they bounce. Ooh, fast, rapid fire bouncing. Forgot about that part. That's another reason you want to grab them. Must be getting close to finishing this level, unless you have to restart every time you perish, in which case I'm maybe not. Ooh, I thought I had done myself in there. Dang it. No, you must not start over. Yeah, That's a good blast. Whoa, oh, I forgot about this. Can't see the lanes. Not really that big a... Whoops. Other than maybe no one when they're in the middle, I suppose. Although you kind of, I don't know, you don't stop there automatically, I don't think. And that was a control error on my part. Alrighty, well, how are we doing here? Game is okay. Uh, maybe I'll have one more go. 25,000. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. I want to... <clears throat> I want to start on level... Was I on level four or five? Whichever one is the Inviso one. <clears throat> it's not the one. Must have been four. Six. <clears throat> no. Okay, I don't know. This is fat. Whoop. Whoopsie. Or is that just a difficulty setting? Maybe that's just. Oh boy. Maybe that's just a straight up difficulty setting. That might just. Oh my gosh, that's tough. Yeah, maybe that's not a level setting. Maybe that's just difficulty what it feels like to me. I didn't last very long, did I? <laughs> Music is a little discordant, to say the least. Alright, let's try this on uh, Psycho level. Well, now you get the 9 on the, on the start screen. Boy, you don't get much time to react there, do you? <laughs> I couldn't even turn around to shoot him fast enough. Oh, dang it. <laughs> Shortest game ever. Okay, <clears throat> I feel like I need one more go on level 9. Whoop, level 9, not level 1. <clears throat> Interesting how it puts you back on level one. It's mildly annoying if you're trying to. Let's say you were trying to get better at level nine, you wouldn't want that behavior. Oh right, you don't want those things bouncing around. Oh my god! <laughs> I, mean, I should just get out of the damn way. 
<laughs> I'm too busy laughing to succeed. <clears throat> One more go. I gotta get more than a thousand points. I forget what I had on the first time I played it. I think it was maybe maybe a thousand or something like that. Oh boy, don't do that. <laughs> it says tricky, man. Trying to get the thing. <laughs> hard, hard, hard. The controls are a little sluggish, I feel. Uh, I'm not quite sure how they could be improved, but it's it's a little touchy to get to the exact lane that you want to get in, get to uh, a lot of the time. In any case, that's a that's a pretty fun game. Good for a quick blast. Quite entertaining. Graphics are decent, nice, colorful sprites and things, and. Sound effects are all right. Music is pretty terrible and discordant. I, I wouldn't actually call it a music. I'd call it more of a sound effect, that, an extended sound effect. <clears throat> In any case, that is uh, Turmoil, 1982 by Sirius. Thanks so much for watching. Take care of yourselves, and I'll see you next time.